I'm going dumpster diving at the thrift store just like I love to do. I made a video recently and this is more footage of this massive clothing haul that was in there. This is a couple days after I made that video. I got a nice little North, North Face fleecy with a big old stain on it. I gotta see if I can clean it. Oh look at this fancy stuff everywhere in there. Keep digging. We got a jean jacket. Nice. <clears throat> it's just an absolute ton of clothing that got dumped in there. There's a nice little fuzzy little hoodie. There's Tinkerbell down there. I don't know what happened. How this many clothes ended up in the dumpster. I think whoever donated them donated kind of dirty stuff, but... <clears throat> They just kept throwing it away, so I got this packable vest right there. I gotta look carefully at that because it's white. It might have stains or general nastiness on it, but I took that. Here's a couple of coats. I just took a bunch of coats recently, and these two were like pretty dirty and cheap, so I think I left them because of that. Here's the second one. It's real dirty. Planet Earth brand. I've never heard of that, but it looked nice. I don't know. I hit the thrift store a couple days on this video, and then I go to Dollar General at the end. Here's a camo Jordan hoodie for kids. It's back to school time. Somebody's going to love getting that. I'm donating that. I think this, I like old school maps like this. Very cool. I think that frame is homemade. Look at it with those brackets. I think somebody just whipped that up, printed out a little picture. Very nice. I think it got some water damage, so I left it. Oh, this is a great find for myself. These are nice running shorts. They have that built-in lining, which is basically like underwear, so I wash them a couple times first. But they're perfectly fine. Well, I mean, they have cigarette burn holes in them. <laughs> somebody was running and smoking at the same time. At least I like to think that, but... They're comfy. I run, run, run around a few times. They're good to go. It's hard to dumpster dive stuff in your size. I don't know what to do with this silver crap. Silver plated crap. I just left it there. It's all tarnish. I don't know. You have to clean it, maybe. Coat. Big coat. No brand. I left it because I just took two big coats like that. I try to give stuff away for free on here. Nobody wanted it. I'll donate it in my neighborhood. I might wait a few weeks for it to get colder than people take things more seriously. Oh, look in the background. The cops rolled up on me. Yeesh. I got the heck out of there in this video and had to go out my emergency exit, basically crawling through the woods, which I haven't done in a few months, and the weeds grew up a lot and I got scratched to heck on my legs everywhere because I had shorts on. There's me scurrying out, hopping a fence like a criminal, jaggedy metal everywhere, logs rolling on me, jaggers trying to jag me. <laughs> and I got a good bit of footage of that. No cops are running through the parking lot after me. That's good. And that's the last bit of it. It took me like three or four minutes to get through the woods though. That was uncomfortable. Here's the next day I go back and the dumpsters got dumped, which means that another dumpster diver was there making it an ungodly mess. I cleaned some of it up, but I, I don't know. This other dumpster, oh look, I had pants on, I wised up. This other dumpster, someone illegally dumped in it. Contractor, see those depot bags? Big rugs everywhere. What a bunch of losers. You need to devil a whole house and then bring the trash to Goodwill. Hope Goodwill's open and legally dump it there. Just rent a dumpster, losers. I got one Jordan. I need to knock it too. It's probably under the demo stuff. Oh, and I'm going to end this video the last minute or so by going to Dollar General, aka DG Market. 
Let's see how much stuff they throw away. I like when they throw away... Oh, that's definitely no good. Brown bananas. Tom. I think... Someone correct me if I'm wrong, but I think... Once lettuce has been chopped, it needs to be refrigerated. That bacteria gets in there. And this stuff has been sitting out overnight. It's the morning now, and they haven't been open for like at least 12 hours at this point. Ew, I jumped in there. I jumped on those bananas. Let <laughs> me see what else was going on. Salad kits. The bags are all heavy as heck. Another whole thing of bananas. Holy moly. Yeah, there's my pants. <laughs> All right, that's basically the end of the video. I think I rip another bag open, but if you've been watching the videos, thank you so much. Like, if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button, like this video, leave a random comment, and I'm out of here. Peace.